guys, what's going on and welcome to day 4 of 13 days of liquid lipstick and today we have is the Too Faced Melted Matte Liquid Lipstick. Now they have a total of 3 shades in India and I have picked out 2 of them which is Sellout and Lady Balls. Now my foundation shade reference is NC40 in MAC and before we can get into the description, the lip swatches, the cons and everything, do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it to notify whenever I upload and now let's jump right into the video. So last night I cut my own bangs and uh, yeah, I don't know what to feel about it. My hair is a mess by the way, it's a total mess. <laughs> Nobody cares. So first let's finish off with the description and the claims of the product. Now it says that it is infused with volulip for a no sting plumping and soothing effect. I have no idea what volulip is and it features avocado oil, vitamin E and hyaluronic filling spears to moisturize and smooth lips. Lightweight long wearing formula wears comfortably. Angled applicator allows for precise and easy application. Now this is priced at 1600 rupees for 7 ml of product and like I mentioned before there are only 3 shades available in India. So this is how the outer packaging looks like which is color coordinated and it has a soft matte finish which I kind of like and everything is embossed on it and you have all the information at the sides, at the back you have the ingredient list as well as the pricing expiry etc and over here again you have all the features and you have the shade name over here as well so this is how the actual liquid lipstick looks like which comes in this unique triangular packaging and uh, it feels nice and luxurious and heavy and it has the writing embossed the gold writing is embossed on it with a gold cap and at the back you have is the shade name and the expiry as well and this is how the doe foot applicator looks like which is like a normal common doe foot applicator So now moving on to the formula. Now this is an extremely comfortable matte liquid lipstick. Now it does not feel like you're wearing a liquid lipstick at all. It feels like a second skin and it is really thin at the same time it is extremely opaque and pigmented as well like one swipe is more than sufficient now for example when i was trying to apply this red color i was actually screwing it up a little bit because my hands were shaking so i had to overline my lips and i had to go over with the second layer just to you know fix it but even with the second layer it does not feel heavy or patchy or anything it's still feels comfortable now at the same time this is not a super hydrating kind of a liquid lipstick nor is it super drying it's like the perfect in between now this is pretty long lasting as well and it lasts for like a minimum of seven to eight hours if you have like a light meal and water or coffee or something of that sort and this is like almost 97 to 96 percent transfer proof like for example like there is a bit of transfer at the same time it is still pigmented so it's not completely transfer proof but there's just a little bit of transfer i feel like the top layer comes off then it is completely fine i'll also quickly insert a video of how it looks once i had a heavy oily meal for removal of this liquid lipstick i could just use a normal micellar water and it removed perfectly fine now coming to the two shades that i have now the first one that i picked up was sellout and it took me such a long time to convince myself to pick it up because i was so hesitant if at all it will suit for my skin tone or not and the price point is higher like it's a luxury brand and I do not want to buy something which will not suit me and I will not apply but then once I got it it was so beautiful I really really love the shade sellout I was not at all expecting that to suit my skin tone at all and after I picked that up is what I picked up Lady Balls. Coming to the price point of 1700 bucks, I feel that for the quantity that you get and if you compare it with other luxury brands it is not so bad at all like 
Hear me out. For example, the Smashbox Always On Liquid Lipstick, that is 2100 rupees for 4 ml of product. So the pricing is high, the quantity is less when you compare it to this one. And even the MAC Retro Matte Liquid Lipstick, that is like 5 ml of product for 2200 rupees. The same thing, the pricing is higher compared to the Too Faced one and the quantity is lesser as well. The last comparison I promise is the Huda Beauty Liquid Lipstick, that is like I think 1825 rupees for 5 ml of product so the quantity is less the pricing is a little bit higher like it's not much of a difference but still the quantity is like 2 ml less than the Too Faced one so when you compare this to the other luxury brands I feel that the Too Faced one is a great purchase when you compare it with the quantity and the price point as well however here comes the con is the number of shades that they have which is so disappointing because on their website tooface.com website the US website they have a total of 29 shades and they launched only a fraction of those shades in India I'm like why I don't get it what, what, was, the what was the reason what was the reason what was the reason so many brands do that which I com I really do not understand because when they have a whole good range of collection and in India when they have to launch they come with like a fraction of the total collection and I honestly do not know why I'm really curious to know though like why so yeah that was my humble opinion about the Too Faced melted matte liquid lipstick and this wraps up today's video you guys I hope you all enjoyed it if you did do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it so if I whenever I upload as well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or requests I will try my best to do that for you as well as follow me on my socials which is Ishanayar on Instagram and Ishanayar on Twitter as well so until the next time take care bye